Here we have a uh, grip tester manufactured by the uh, Gottlieb Manufacturing Company out of Chicago. This is considered the uh, three-way deluxe grip tester because uh, there are actually three ways for someone to be able to uh, try and test their, uh, their strength. The first way is to grip the uh, center grip here and squeeze. The second way would be to grab these two side arms and pull them out. Or the third way would be to grab the side arms and push together uh, to try and, uh, and, and, register, and register it. So uh, again, it's the, the deluxe three-way. This machine was also sold without these side arms as just a standard grip tester. Um, this was uh, very tastefully restored uh, several years ago. Still shows very nicely. Um, these are great. Uh, machines, really brilliant marketing when you think about it because of the way that they designed this, uh, the front scale. It actually has uh, guides for both men and women by age what their strength should be. So it's a way of uh, really encouraging people and kind of testing on their curiosity. Oh, here's, a, here's the value. I wonder if I can, uh, can reach that level. So uh, great reproduction graphics on the side of the cabinet that would uh, have matched the originals and uh, all redone chrome which looks uh, really nice and just a nice pop to the machine. If um, before we start you have to put a penny in of course to uh, to get started and you would uh, if the needle showed something uh, else you could push that button and reset it. We drop a penny in. Let's try pulling apart first and see how far we do. Here. Okay so we got up to about uh, 110, 115. Not too bad. Let's see if we can uh, do a little better when we squeeze. If you squeeze it far enough, uh, it actually uh, rings a bell. So let's see if we can get the bell to ring. There's a pretty nice gong inside. There we go. So you have to get up to about 220 or so to ring the bell. And uh, we did. So reset it and uh, let the next person come along and try it. So this is the Gottlieb Deluxe three-way strength tester. Uh, manufactured probably in the late 1930s into the early 1940s. These were very popular uh, machines for general store uh, kind of use and uh, penny arcades and so on.